welcome. Thank you for joining me for my 39th part of The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. Mm -hmm. After creating the construct, we have now made contact with the Sage of Spirit, Minoru, mm -hmm. and with her help are now heading to the Spirit Temple to acquire the Secret Stone of Spirit. Mm -hmm. I hope you enjoy this part of the story, and while you're enjoying, please help me out by taking a minute to like this video, subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, mm -hmm. click the notification bell, and comment comments below. Thank you, Link. Now only one task remains. We must recover my secret stone. It should be located here. Please, Link, let us go there together. The path will be very dangerous. Fortunately, this construct body you have built for me is hardly helpless. There is a platform nearby where we can explore its potential. Now hurry, Link. We must recover my secret stone. Do I have to do it while I'm in it? <laughs> Oh, my God. 
Using this construct isn't exactly very cool. But maybe I just need to get used to it and then I will be better at using it to fight him. No, forgive this. I'm not using it anymore. I think I just used all my fairies. I got one left though.
Doesn't really help. Huh? I mean, I guess it could. Huh? Rockets. Thank <laughs> you. 
Ow. Why won't it let me attach it? Whatever, it'll let me attach that.
Okay, what's in here? Hmm. I made it long ago. But the glow... It must be under the control of something monstrous. Scourge of the Spirit. The Seized Construct. If the Demon King has turned my creation into his pawn, we must defeat it. We can do this together, Link. We have to stop that construct. <laughs> this thing is quite sturdy. We keep knocking it over, but that is all. are very dangerous. Be careful. Maybe we can make use of the devices around us. Out more arms. Be careful. Don't get thrown off by how fast it moves. Just move until it stops, then attack.
We won't last long at this rate. We need to find another approach. Zelda asked me to aid you, Link. I am the Sage of Spirit, and one of the Zonai. Minimal. I am glad to meet you, Link. I must thank you. It is because of you that we have recovered my secret stone. Originally, my intent was to awaken when you first found the Porapad, then to guide you to my construct and assist you on your journey. I had not anticipated a battle with that same construct. You have proven quite adept, and I am grateful for all your efforts. Link, here. In 
the name of Minoru, Sage of Spirit, I grant my power unto you. I believe it will serve you well. With this power I've given, a deep bond has been forged between us. And from this point forward, my spirit will reside within that construct. I will help you however I can. Aha! Long ago, my people known as the Zonai came down from the heavens to the surface of the world. It was said they were descendants of gods. They bore treasures from these same gods, secret stones capable of amplifying the abilities of those who possessed them. Using the knowledge of the Zonai, my younger brother Raru became a great leader. He met a young woman named Sonia, and they would wed. Raru gifted Sonia one of the secret stones. Together, they sought to establish their kingdom. This is how the Kingdom of Hyrule, with Rauru and Sonya as its first king and queen, came to be. The future looked bright. However, tragedy suddenly struck. A man of great evil emerged from the desert. The leader of the Gerudo, Ganondorf, killed Queen Sonya and stole her secret stone. Using the Secret Stone, Ganondorf transformed into the Demon King. He then created swarms of monsters and attacked. Hyrule rose up to face these threats, but the evil power driving the monsters forward was staggering. The defenders were on the brink of defeat. Raru then came up with a plan to turn the tide of the war. He entrusted secret stones to warriors with exceptional abilities. They became sages and united in an effort to finally defeat the Demon King. Raru and the sages outnumbered the Demon King and should have been able to stop him. However... The Demon King's power had grown far beyond anything we could have imagined. I was unable to withstand his strength. Our fight appeared all but lost. And then, Raru.
committed himself to one final act. <laughs> Ganondorf! so smug. I know exactly what it will cost me. Uh, Raru! <laughs> Thousands of years will pass on the blink of an eye. You only delay the inevitable. You're wrong. Years from now, someone will appear with the sword that seals the darkness. A swordsman with the power to defeat you, Link. Remember this name. Well then. You're saying that sword traveled through time the same way you did? Yes, but more importantly, in my original time, the Demon King was vulnerable to even the smallest piece of this sword. Even someone like him has vulnerabilities. Hmm. Then... What exactly are you suggesting we do with the sword? Over time, the Master Sword is able to absorb sacred power. It can heal itself, and even grow stronger. Curious. If we were able to empower it in that way, it could be the key to defeating the Demon King. But it could take centuries for that sword to grow strong enough. The power the Demon King wields... I do not see how this can be done. It would be impossible for you to provide it with sacred power for so long. I can think of one way. You mean... Yes, I can do it. I have to. I've told you. That act is forbidden for a very good reason. It would mean throwing yourself away. <laughs> oh, Minoru! <gasps> You... 
won't be able to change back. The moment I had the sword, I knew what to do. I knew this was why I came to this era. I... I want to restore the Master Sword and deliver it to Link. I understand. You really have made up your mind? Very well, then. As a Zonai, I bear my share of blame for these events. So I, too, will devote myself to this goal and to this hero of yours. For the Swordsman Link, I will do everything I can. Even if my body should perish, I will still be with you in spirit. Well then. Well then. The vow of Minaru, Sage of Spirit. Huh? fast. That must have been getting it. Mm -hmm. Now back to the surface. Time to go cook some food at home. There it is. Oh. Yes, I have a couple apples for you. Hmm. Or I have a couple apples that you can have. Hmm.
I'm not even sure if I have enough to look. Oh. That'll be good. <laughs> Well, that's pretty much all the cooking stuff I have, huh? 42, huh? Let's see, do you have more arrows? You do, huh? This one, if the fairies are back home. Thank <laughs> you. 
That's an interesting island, hmm? I wonder how I would even get up there, hmm? Fairies are back. Oh. Well, cool is the construct. I don't want the construct, though. Construct, go away, hum. I don't want you to scare away my fairies. Looks like there's only three this time. There's fairies. Let's see him. Um, also, wonder what those are about. Hmm? There was that one mountain peak over here in Breath of the Wild. Let's see, where is the Tenno? Tenno's there. I think it's right there. I wonder if there's fairies there still. Only one way to find out. Uh -huh. There's a sword. Huh? It's a Schmitter, I think. That was it. It was either that or it was right there, huh? Remember if it was this close to Hatano, though. Hmm. Looks like a heart. Well, 
that didn't work as well as I thought I did. Or I thought it would. Hmm. Constructor. There are no fairies, so. But this is definitely shaped like a heart. There's somebody there. Savak. Mm. Well, I have a carrot. Does that work? I think this is or it was, but this isn't it anymore. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, I didn't want to exit the map. Arrow field. There's no islands. Well, there's a lake there. I don't remember if there were fairies there when I got the shrine or not, but let's take a look. Hmm. Nope, no fairies. Mm -hmm. Some. Oh, that's a Stambul, though. There's another one. There's another one. Mm -hmm. take a look at this and see if there's something that I can see about it.
Probably should have just warped to the shrine there, hmm? Stuff it, buddy. Hmm. Ah, hmm. I need a shield. Hmm. Ah, so much for getting the fairies. I mean, at least I had it, but. That's not what I wanted to do. Gotcha. I didn't want to activate your ability, Riju. <laughs> up here. No, but there's more meat. Mm. I can cook the meat. Mm. It's a well, home. Huh? And it's the Stable trotter, so I drained it. <laughs> Cook the meat that I got. Do a carrot and an apple. So, or can I not cook those? Uh, there they are. Huh? Store health depleted by gloom when used in cooking. Hmm. See what they do with the apples. Hmm. I guess I should have paid attention to that earlier because that would have been nice to know. I 
have a feeling I might need a lot of these coming into the final battle and the final dungeon. Mm -hmm. To the apple and the three meats. Mm -hmm, mm Heal my heart some. Oh, it's you, hmm? Oh. Tropical region in the south. Mm. Huh. After completing the spirit temple, we set out to look for some supplies to prepare for the final battle. Home. If you've enjoyed this part of the story, please help me out by taking a minute to like this video. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already, click the notification bell, share with a friend, and comment below. And I will see you in the next part where we will continue Link's journey. Until then, check out some of my other videos, and thank you for watching.